people going in and storming, and it's a huge humanitarian problem. And I just say this, the United States has tremendous problems of their own. We have infrastructure that we have to fix. We have bridges and roads and tunnels, and everything's falling apart. Our oh, nation's yeah. in such trouble. That's why being a builder, and a great builder, and a very successful builder, I think will greatly help. But we have so many of our own problems, including the border, including the wall, which we will get built, including all of the things we have, health care, which is a mess. You know, if you look at Obamacare, the premiums have gone up 45, 50, 55 percent. People are saying this is turning out to be a disaster. The deductibles are through the roof. The deductibles on Obamacare, it's through the roof. So we have a lot of problems. We have to take care of our vets. We have to build up our military. Just the other day, General Ordiano said that the Army is in the worst shape in its history in terms of preparedness. Now, for them to be in bad shape with the way we are and with the world hating us, and you look at Hillary Clinton, and I've said she's the worst Secretary of State in the history of this country. Now, in all fairness, because of the agreement that's about to be finalized with Iran, John Kerry may very well take her place. I think that agreement is a disaster for this country, for Israel, for the Middle East. It's going to lead to nuclear proliferation, the 24-day clause, everything about, we don't even get our prisoners back. You say, who negotiates a thing like that? That won't happen, I can guarantee you, with the President Trump. All right, one or two more questions.